this is not my first time to live in sleep farm is actually my second time this sleep farm is very much significant to me because it touched me on a personal level accused number 9 is actually my grandfather uh, mr elias mozoledi first time i saw him he was an old man and unfortunately he didn't get to enjoy freedom because he was buried actually on the day that mandela was inaugurated the 10th of may 1994 I, i i see this place and i realize just the courage that this man had you know the courage to sit around the table and say we are going to be the ones that work at a solution for this country generation democracy is carrying on what was started at lilis leaf through the many interactive programs that they have brought through i mean the past four days of this wonderful workshop has taught me that if something is wrong in one country it affects all of us so for, for generation democracy to be here with us today and doing this it it couldn't have come at a better place Nelson Mandela and my grandfather were here today that probably say we are proud that you have decided to to be involved in your government we are proud to see that you want to take your country and your government responsible and you want to work together with them to come here and reflect really to 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 go back to basics uh, in a sense to say to yourself am i living up to the standards of these people and what they have fought for how do i through generation democracy advance their own cause and this is really the place where we need to find ourselves as the young people and say we will be heard because we've seen what um, our, our, the people that came before us did for our countries and therefore we carry the torch forward and hold government responsible in, in the end <laughs>